Hey guys, welcome to part 6 of my Mario Odyssey playthrough. And in today's episode, we are going to be leaving the Lake Kingdom and headed to the Wooded Kingdom. I'm very excited to get going because I'm not, I'm not, I'm not I mean, I'm not going to like, I'm, <laughs> I don't know. It's just, this hasn't been my favorite kingdom overall. This is probably been my least favorite kingdom we've gone to. But we did get a sticker for it, Lake Lamode. So that looks really cool in the Odyssey. I actually bought that in between episodes, I'm pretty sure, because I'm pretty sure I didn't get that in the last episode. But we are heading off to another kingdom. Like I said, we're heading over to the Wooded Kingdom, where we think Bowser might be hiding. So let's head there right now. And let's fly off in the Odyssey with our new sticker. Yeah. Oh, I can see it. I can see our new sticker. I like that you can put stickers on the Odyssey. I didn't know you could do that. But, um, we're headed in on our very not, not definitely not a hat-shaped hat ship. I still don't know why everything is hat-shaped, but it is. So, whoever heard of a wedding with a stolen dress, let's get after that tactless fiend. Seeing as how we got some time to kill, let's review some useful skills. Travel tips, spin throw. When you're surrounded by enemies and you just wish you could hit them all at once, snap the pro controller to decide to do a spin throw or your hat will spin all around you. Well, there it is. Next, let's read it from the Wooden Kingdom. According to this guy, there's a giant greenhouse there filled with flowers. It's famous for its beautiful, I do not know how to say that, bouquet. That's like the, the most weird spelling of a word I've ever seen. I don't think it's in English. Anyway, Wooded Kingdom Steam Gardens. These are super pretty. It looks like there's snow in the background. So, that's cool, I guess. But, Road to the Sky Garden. What? This is, like, really cool, this kingdom. There's, like, goo and piranha plants. But, like, other than that, look at this forest. It looks so pretty. And what are these? Are these, like... These robots, they look like they should be in the trash. I'm not even gonna lie. Like, they look dirty and rusted. And, like, they don't belong here. Anyway, let's let's see. If the purple coins, we don't have any, but, like, spend money. Okay. I mean, I like the explorer outfit and the scientist outfit, but, like, he's just, like, spending money. Like, <laughs> you're, like, you go into a store. Uh, think about it. You walk into a store, and you go up to the guy at the front, and you, like, put all your products down. Or actually, no, that's the wrong. <laughs> that's the wrong idea. Um, what is the Sphinx doing here? Greetings, traveler, and to your hat as well. Can you answer my return? What does the monster want from this kingdom? Flowers, I think. Right? You are correct. Perhaps that wasn't much of a riddle. Anywho, proceed. All right. So, as I was saying, you go into a store and like. You go up to the front, and you're like, hey, what does this store sell? And the guy's just like, spend money. Like, he doesn't even answer your question. He's just like, spend money. Like, just do it. Just do it. Come, like, come on. You know you want it. Just spend money. Like, they're literally ordering you. They're, they're like, spend money or I call the police. <laughs> it's like the weirdest thing to start, like, a conversation with. Just spend money. All right, anyway, let's um, focus on the task at hand, which is finding the flower garden and trying to get to this flag, which I'm having very much trouble doing. All right, we got it. Iron Road entrance. And then there's a pond down here. And there's nothing in it. Okay. Let's, oh, I see flowers. I see flowers. What are those things? Those are like weird potted plants all right um hold b to stretch so i stretched and we gotta capture it again i guess oh okay and then wait what i don't know what to do i'm confused i'm confuzzled oh okay that makes a lot of sense i get it now all right. Anyway, let's continue in our very, I mean, I wouldn't call it fancy, but it's very 
non-fitting attire, or also known as a swimsuit, and why is the ground breaking beneath my feet? Oh, good. I was like, oh no, that we're not coming back. Um, let's climb up the pool, and let's get to the top where there are piranha plants, and that is, um, and we got hurt because that goo hurts you apparently. So that's a good thing to know, but there is a heart, so... And we just lost it again. Okay. And, uh, we died. Wonderful! Just the way I wanted to start this video. By dying. Mm-hmm. Right, just the way I wanted to start the video. By getting a heart, jumping in goop, so I lost the heart, and then we get hit with a goo ball or whatever it is something is the something hit us i think the piranha plant shot something at us i'm not completely sure but um something happened and i didn't like it <laughs> so we just have to move on you know we died you just have to move on you just have to you that's a, that's a life lesson right there guys when you die in life just move on that's like it's it you just have to move on. That That's really it. Just move. Move on. Like, life goes on. What is in here? Oh, there is a blue power moon. The nut in the red maze. All right. Okay. Cool. Anyway, let's head down here and dodge that guy barely. And stuck under there and get all these coins, which is very nice. And then we jump on here and... Wait, what? What do I do? Oh, wait, I have to go under and push it up and then jump on it. Okay, that makes sense. And then we break this. Oh, <gasps> purple coins. Nice. We have, like, 23 purple coins. I bet it... I mean, do you want me to be wearing a um, an explorer outfit in the next episode, guys? Because, like, that would be cool. Because I, I guess it... I mean, if we're leaving this... Oh, what? I didn't realize what I just did. I just, like, took out, like, a boss or something. I just, like, totally eliminated the piranha plant. Wow. That's cool. I guess. But, um... Not exactly... Good. Because... I don't know what I was going to say. I, I was kind of just like looking around, taking in the scenes, and I forgot I was recording a video. I was literally like, mm, this seems nice. And I just like stalled with, oh, and we died. Okay. <laughs> I just like stalled with my wor words because I forgot that I was filming a video. So I was just like, um, okay. So, anyway, let's continue on and pretend that never happened. So, we're going to run along here, which is cool. And then we're going to run over here while the ground is breaking. And we're going to try and survive. And we did not survive. Okay. So, we, that was a long death. Like, that was stretched out. And, like, it was a bit too stretched out that, like, it seems purposeful. But anyway, as I, I think I was saying this before I got, like, lost in thought for a second. But, um, even though we're going to probably be leaving this kingdom in the next episode. I mean, I don't know. Maybe we won't be leaving in this kingdom in the next episode. But either way, I just kind of want an explorer outfit. So, uh, I don't know. I guess we should just, you know, get one, try it on. But I think there's a power moon up here, because last time I cracked a nut, there was a power moon in it, and I am struggling with that. I was, like, mantling up and down, and, um, my foot fell asleep. You're wonderful. This is, like, the perfect time for my foot to fall asleep, because I'm just sitting down and playing. Okay. See, I th I'm going to blame that on my foot, because... See, I'm just sitting down playing video games, and my foot fell asleep, and I died. So they're obviously connected. Th like, I'm just saying, that that was my foot's fault right there. That was totally my foot's fault. Like, you can even tell in the way that I died, 
that just my foot my foot did it like it i don't know it's just something something did it like I, that was not my fault that was 100 percent my foot's fault but yeah it it yeah yeah totally but uh you know let's just continue on in the tower the sky garden tower okay this looks actually really cool i like this land a lot it's very pretty and we are walking up here and we uh barely made it let's take over this guy and let's see is anything up here yes there's stuff up there oh that's good i like that that makes me very happy but let's press this and let's walk along here and oh wait is this a power moon that's a power moon yes nut planted in the tower all right i mean good right wonderful oh no 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 okay good i didn't know oh no 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 I didn't know that if that was coming back or not, so it just like disappeared, and I was like, no. Wait, go, go, run, 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 run. Run as fast as your little legs can carry you. Run. What? No. All right, I think we made it. I think we're free of flower bridges for a lifetime now. Hopefully, they don't appear later, but uh, wait, I think I saw a shadow. Yeah, I was wondering what that was for a second. I wonder, is it like a coin? Oh, we know it's a power moon. You got a moon stretching your legs. Yes, I did. Um, we're walking through here. And let's see. Oh, the Brutals. So we're obviously fighting the one we haven't fought yet, which is the blue, the one with the blue clothes. So, uh, yeah, yeah. See the one with the long hair, blue clothes, spiked hat. Looks very fancy. Um, what do you want? Too late, chumps. We snagged the whatever that's called bouquet already. Now why don't you scram so we can grab the rest of the flowers as well? Or maybe I'll just make you scram. Okay. Oh, dear. All right. So let's just, like, act like this never happened and run up here and attack this guy. All right. So he spits goo. Now I jump on his head, but then he starts... Yeah, this is a problem. He starts going around with goo, and I have a rock, and I don't know why I have a rock. And while I'm doing this, my foot is still asleep, so that's probably gonna make me die. If I die, you know why. And um, now he's doing this thing again. He's a very annoying boss, I will say this. He's very annoying. I wouldn't say he's hard. He's very annoying, and he's already cost me two hearts, but luckily I got one of those back. And a uh, common theme this episode, I get one back and I immediately lose it. And then I lose another one. So I lost my three extra hearts, but I did beat him right after. So that's very nice. And we get our multi-moon. So let's claim that. And let's fly around with our multi-moon. Because we deserve it. Don't we? So, let's see. Yeah. Flower Thieves of Sky Garden. We got it. We're done. We're great. We have the multi moon. We're going back to our Odyssey and we win. Right? We win. Uh, Path to the Secret Flower Field. Okay. There's more. What is that? What is that? There's like a robot thing. Anyway, that's not it for this world, I guess. So, yeah, you just did see something land up there. I'm sure of it, because I've watched it too. But, uh, let's go over here to the purple guy. Spend money, yeah, exactly. Is this the desired selection? Yes, we want to get an entire explorer outfit. So, um, that's nice. We got it now. Like, we got, we changed into it now. So, I guess we're going to be wearing that for next episode. Anything else? Hmm. Hmm. Let me get the flowers. The flowers, where do, I think those go inside your Odyssey. So, we should go check that out. And I like how the guy was like, well, come back and buy things. Like, do it. I just bought three products and don't, 
I look good. Oh my gosh, I look amazing with my flower that makes me go speedy, and I did not know that you can do that. But Mario just went neom. But anyway, what's back here? I feel like there's something secret back here. I don't know why. Oh, yeah, there's purple coins. Is that it? Is that it? Oh, wait. Oh, no. No, did we die? Come on. Wait, what? What? Deep woods? Huh? Wait. Pulling? Did I just discover, like... A whole nother world? What? I am very confuzzled right now. Like, I just, I thought I died. I think that's the way to get back up. Oh, yeah. We literally, oh, my God, there's a T-Rex. There's a T-Rex, and there's Goombas, and there's a T-Rex, and there's Goombas, and there's a T-Rex. Why is the T-Rex down here? So, are we in, like, a boss fight now? Or is he just gonna chase... What is that thing? What did I just find? What is that little Goomba thing? That's... Oh, those are, those are one of the coin purse guys, I think. I've heard about them before. Um, I didn't know they were in this game, but obviously this area is not supposed to be found. I wonder, is this, like... <laughs> is this area just, like... A total area that was not supposed to be in this game I wonder probably not but like imagine this part of the level where is the moon where's the moon anyway imagine this part of the level was like never supposed to be added to the game but they just tested it out uh, that, that would have been funny if I just like totally like hacked the game and just found like a secret area good thing why oh, okay this I'm sorry I have been very confused today with all the features in this level. So, I think that um, this would probably be a good time to head back up. Yeah, I think that we've done what we needed to do in the deep woods, which was almost die by a T-Rex. So, now that we're back up here... I think we should end the episode. So anyway, thank you guys so much for watching, and I hope to see you in part 7. Bye!